Panda. Tire 1 is airborne. Or rather, Tire 50, but let's go for it. Operation. They're propaganda machine. We should familiarize ourselves with their MO. The man at the top is El Cardinal, an excommunicated priest turned Santa Muerta proponent. He's also supposed to be the spiritual advisor to El Sueño. Other guy in the mix is Ramon Feliz. He used to be a legit journalist till he inexplicably started blogging for the cartel. Familiarize yourself with Bowman's briefing on Santa Blanca's coke production pipeline. People at the top are El Yayo and La Gringa. Yayo's Bolivian, an ex-cocalero turned cocaine producer. Gringa seems to be a disgraced chemist. She used to work for an NGO here in Bolivia before joining up with the cartel. We got civilians in the area. Tango's down. Okay, we're still alright. Tango marked. He's a little close. They really to ought to have added the uh, new enemy archetypes into the tire one mode. That's my first feedback. I don't know if they have, but it doesn't seem like it. bullet. We can't scare a corpse. We're clear. Y'all good? Ah, wrong button. It happens easily. It looks like we have discovered a region, but I can't see any missions, meaning that we might actually have to discover the missions all over again. But that's just an educated guess on my part. Yeah, missions are registered as actually completed, so it doesn't seem like we actually have to redo them. However, I think we might actually benefit from just going here and seizing some of the supplies. Yeah, so far Tire 1 doesn't seem to be 
that much different. I would have liked if they had implemented a reward system bringing DLC weapons and DLC enemies into the actual game. Now, that opportunity seems to have been damn wasted, if you ask me. Now, they might actually have done so, but I don't think so. It seems like most of the items you can get are new ones or... <sighs> stuff like that, and maybe the enemies are more difficult, but so far I haven't actually experienced it, so I suppose we'll just have to travel down the tier system and see what happens. for indirect fire. Roger that. Mortars away. Oh, you have got to be kidding me! I sincerely hope more difficult just doesn't mean that they can take more bullets. Because if that's the case, this is just shit. Didn't I shoot that guy? Clear over here. Fairly convinced I shot that guy. Well, now we're sure. Hurry up! Let's try the next mission, see if we, we can do better on that one.
How do I get this in the open? An enemy. No idea we need to, bird approach to stay shoot down. him now. We need to close with the enemy. Make sure they don't steal the chopper again. On the run. That was not a surrendering enemy kill, that was an enemy who actually ran killed. Clear on my side. Much better. I'll pilot. Santa Blanca Control, this is Supply Chopper 1128, requesting clear passage to destination, over. like tower blocked our excuse so let's just put her down here and deliver the stuff good work we can leave the chopper here and the rebels will pick it up For our next mission, I'm going to prepare a shotgun and basically all my... Yeah, I'm gonna prepare what I call the Rhino. It's a personal joke of mine, I don't feel like explaining it right now, but... Anyhow, the big shotgun is called Rhino and that's all you need to know right now. Oh, I actually need to manually activate the level up as well. I seem to have skills, yes, yes. Haven't actually filled up all of these, so. The Rhino is the biggest, baddest <coughs> shotgun I can ever devise, and we are going to use it for a very special purpose.
We've got a positive ID on the cartel senior instructor, a former army ranger named Carl Bookhart. The guy broke bad when he went to work for the cartel. Now we've got to eliminate him. Come on, what better way to test a new tire mode than to shoot a tire operator, a ranger? We didn't pick the Santa Blanca chopper this time around, so maybe the SAM sites will object to us. Yeah, they don't really like us, do they? Who knew that is not alert? There is no fucking way Midas can hit anything from up here. Shoot the llamas! Shoot the llamas! Hey, Ubisoft, where's that a uh, customization again? Gonna have to do this the hard way. Infiltrate, infiltrate. Well, the chopper seems intent on killing us all. Told you! So I got run over by chopper and got my face buried in a rock. Those things happen, right? We don't have any sniper weapons or anything like that. We're gonna sneak into the mine and take out the object. We're closing in on Bookhart's last known location. We really gonna do this, boss? Kill one of our own? Bookhart stopped being our brother the day he went to work for the cartel. You see him, you take him out. No hesitation. Sniper on that roof. I see a second target. It is tempting to try and take out the sniper, but we're not gonna do that. It's far more trouble than it's worth. I want the guys inside the mines to be unaware. Heads up, narco with a submachine gun by the camp entrance. Jesus, smells like a slaughterhouse in here. The hell kind of training is Bookhart doing? The first thing a Sicario recruit learns is what it's like to kill a human being. They bring in prisoners and make the recruits take turns on them with hammers and machetes. Sometimes it's men, sometimes women, sometimes it's little kids. And the recruits know that if they hesitate, they're next. At least four or five targets up ahead. I got a third. I got a target carrying submachine guns. I need a better position. Let Most me get in position. On the target. No target. 
Repeat. Got a tango. No target. Got it. Moving. Target the heavies. I say again, target the heavies. Could you please hurry up and acquire your line of sight, please? That's gonna happen in this mine, right? Charge. Yeah, I wonder where my team was doing all that. Is it too much to ask of you to clear the area first? Go. Frag out. Rhino is good. Let's go. We have, however, been engaged, so picking up that machine gun is a bit tempting, really. They know we're here. We can get rid of the... Silencer thing. Frag out, yes. Frag out. Come here, culeros. Go. You think you can take me, asshole? Breathe. Show me what you got. Fuck. Bookhart made me. He's on the run. Come on, operator. Get some. Let's see how tough you are. It's over, Bookhart. You're done. Got eyes on Bookhart. Target marked. Frag out. Get some. Go. Let's get out of here. We got him. Bookhart's dead. Hell of a way for a ranger to die. Bookhart chose this. Don't forget that. We did what we had to do. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on.
We've got a location on Liuri and El Polito. Let's pay these fuckers back for what they did to Sandoval. I don't care how you do it, so long as they both end up dead. I asked the rebels to send over a vehicle for us. Oh, come on! That's not even close to where I wanted it. Supplies will buy us a lot of goodwill from the rebels. I'll drive. Heads up, hostile presence. Well, there it is. Let's grab it. This time we're actually gonna switch out the shotgun for, I don't know, maybe a heavy machine gun or something like that, that spews bullets out in a... Yeah, something like that. I don't really see the point in going silent on this one. We're going for the light machine gun. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you guys behind. You guys can teleport either way. I don't know why I'm tagging along with three operators who can teleport. I mean, if they can teleport, why the hell doesn't they just teleport to the VIP, shoot them and go? We all know the answer to that, because if we had, if they couldn't teleport, it would be really annoying to wait for them. Yeah, this is gonna be a long flight. Just bear with me. I am somewhat tempted to try and engage the convoy, but that's not really our job right now. Our job is to take down Yuri and El Blito. might be a SAM launcher somewhere around here, and if so, we need to be really careful. Yep, there it is. I don't think they got a shot off before we got out of range. I can't see a missile either way. And we're heading into Itaqua now. There are no SAM launchers there.
Oh, I spoke too soon. Fuck me. Let's see if the chopper tries to kill us this time. I wouldn't actually put it past it, it might be a murderous chopper for all I know. Yeah, I feel I have to do this with the amazing lightning we have here. So I'm gonna just turn on Nvidia Ansel, see if we can get a decent view of it. Yeah, like that. Enhance and resolution check. Go. Now when that's done with, let's go get El Yuri and El Polito. That's a really nice sunrise. on the lodge. Stay alert. We got Tango. Stage her close. Move in. Watch those doorways and corners. This must be where Sandoval cashed in. Bowman said they kept him alive for 47 hours. Tough son of a bitch held out for a long time. I feel like he was waiting for us to come get him and we're real fucking late. Time to make it right. Cariño, who were you before you met me? Mamacita, I was nobody. Nothing. I could not have even imagined a life so deep, a love so full as the love Let's I Let's shut the guy up. Oh god, I feel the same. I... Having a flashbang. Seriously? Open fire. Doing a flashback. Not another one. Seriously? At least the guy was affected, but might just get the fuck out of my line of fire. Target down. Whoever the fuck you are, I'm gonna bleed you slow. You are not gonna do that. Hey, apparently the flashbangs were better than anticipated. Hey, flash it. Flashbang. Target down. Yuri and Polito have been terminated. You know how in the movies people always act like revenge isn't satisfying? Like it doesn't make them feel any better? Sure. Well, I feel fucking great. Taking out that lovey-dovey horror show also earned us some points with the locals. Make contact when you find something new. Bowman out. That was far too easy. Why do you keep a minigun in a torture room either way? Especially with the line of fire. I mean, all these tables are in the way. Uh, there was a lot of things to take cover behind for that minigun to not be effective. I can understand it might be used as a torture device, but still, damn, that's a fucking poor planning. Apparently the mission was considered so fucking easy we didn't get the next tire level for it. But hey, I'm just here to show it off, so... Uh, that'll be all for tonight.